I hope you have been enjoying my videos on cross-dressing. My next video will have a forced feminization theme. I hope you like the idea of being forced into a bra and panties and women's clothes, complete with a wig and makeup. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss the next video. Andrew and his girlfriend, Emily, had been together for several years. They shared many interests and had built a life full of love and trust. However, Emily had a unique passion that she had never shared with Andrew until one evening during a heart-to-heart -heart conversation. Andrew, there's something I've always wanted to try, and I hope you can understand, Emily said, her eyes searching his for reassurance. Of course, Sam. You know you can tell me anything, Andrew replied, sensing her hesitation. Emily took a deep breath and continued, I've always been fascinated by the idea of transformation, particularly cross-dressing. I'd love to see you dress as a girl, just once, to explore this side of yourself and to see how it feels. Andrew was taken aback. He had never considered dressing in women's clothing before. The idea made him uncomfortable, but he saw the earnestness in Emily's eyes and didn't want to disappoint her. He agreed to try it, hoping it would be a one-time thing. The following weekend, Emily prepared everything. She had bought a selection of lingerie, dresses, wigs, and makeup. She carefully laid out the items on the bed, turning their bedroom into a makeshift salon. Andrew felt a knot in his stomach as he looked at the array of feminine clothing. Are you ready, Andrew? Emily asked with a reassuring smile. Andrew nodded hesitantly. I guess so. Let's do this. She had Andrew step into the shower and shave his entire body. It felt very different to be completely smooth and hairless. Emily handed him a pair of lace panties and a matching bra and a garter belt with stockings. Start with these. Take your time. I'll be right here. Andrew slipped into the delicate undergarments, feeling the unfamiliar texture against his skin. It felt strange, but also oddly exciting. The panties felt very nice, and the stockings on his freshly shaven legs felt wonderful. Andrew was very surprised by how much he was enjoying this. Emily then helped him into a soft, pink dress that flowed around his legs. The dress was light and airy, and Andrew couldn't help but marvel at the sensation. Next came the makeup. Emily was meticulous, applying foundation, eyeshadow, and lipstick with practiced hands. Andrew watched in the mirror as his reflection transformed. He could hardly recognize the person looking back at him. Finally, Emily placed a long, auburn wig on his head and styled it gently. She stepped back to admire her work. You look beautiful, Holly, she said, using the name she had chosen for his female persona. Andrew, now Holly, felt a mix of emotions. There was discomfort, but also a strange sense of curiosity and excitement. Emily's enthusiasm was contagious, and Holly couldn't help but feel a bit of pride in the transformation. Emily encouraged Holly to walk around and get used to the heels she had provided. It was awkward at first, but with Emily's guidance, Holly began to move more confidently. They spent the evening together, with Emily teaching Holly how to embrace her femininity. They laughed, shared stories, and even danced around the living room. Over the next few weeks, Emily continued to encourage Holly to explore this new side of herself. At first, Holly felt like she was doing it solely for Emily's pleasure. But gradually, she began to see the experience differently. Dressing as Holly allowed Andrew to tap into emotions and aspects of his personality he had never explored before. It was liberating in a way he hadn't expected. One day, while they were out shopping, Emily suggested they look for some new outfits for Holly. Andrew hesitated, feeling exposed and vulnerable. But Emily held his hand and reassured him. You're not alone in this, Holly. We're doing this together. With Emily's support, Holly gained confidence. She began to enjoy the process of choosing dresses, skirts, and accessories. 
She loved experimenting with different styles and looks. Holly wasn't just a character to please Emily anymore. She was becoming an integral part of who Andrew was. As Holly, Andrew discovered a newfound sense of self-acceptance. He realized that embracing his femininity didn't diminish his masculinity. It enhanced his understanding of himself. He felt more complete, more balanced. Emily's request had initially felt like a challenge, but it turned into a journey of self-discovery for Andrew. Holly became a cherished part of their relationship, bringing them closer than ever. Through this experience, Andrew learned the importance of vulnerability, trust, and the beauty of embracing all facets of oneself. In the end, Holly wasn't just a persona created to please Emily. She was a reflection of Andrew's true self, a testament to the power of love and acceptance. And in embracing Holly, Andrew found a deeper connection to himself and to the woman he loved.